everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 48, and this is war number five. And we're going up against an alliance called Rodents of Unusual Size. Oh, I like this alliance already. Oh my goodness, that is awesome. Do you guys get that reference? <laughs> Are you asses? Rodents of Unusual Size? Doesn't exist. As you wish. Okay, anyway. Um, let's see who they've banned. Okay, Domino, Iceman, and Kushala. All right. Let's see what they got planned for us. Kind of late getting in here. The weekend is usually late. Uh-huh. Okay. So, we've got... Um, Spider-Ham, who does not benefit from the node. I could bring in Venom if I really wanted to for that one. But then we've got this guy here, Falcon. He, um, he's annoying. He definitely gets armor ups. So he benefits from the node. Hmm. Uh, I don't like him. Now, I can easily use, like, Namor against him, but I could also use um, Hulkling. And here we have Magneto. And let's see. Overseer does not benefit from this node. So I can just bring in a counter. I mean, Hulkling could do that fight as well. Hmm. Honestly, Hulkling can do three of these fights. Magneto for future Ant-Man, Hulkling for all the others, which gives me a slot to deal with uh, one of the minis here. Hmm. Oh, they put all of their um, global defenders. Oh, e. Okay. Um, let me think. This maestro. Hmm. You know. Hulkling might be able to do that fight as well. But I think I think I'm going to bring in Nick Fury. Yeah, I think I'm going to bring in Nick Fury. Nick Fury can also do uh, the Overseer so that I'm not putting everything on uh, Hulkling. <clears throat> so, like, uh, Nick Fury could do Spider-Ham, Overseer, and Maestro. Magneto does Future Ant-Man. Hulkling does, well, hmm. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Hulkling, Nick Fury, and... Um, Magneto. I'm just thinking, depending on how the fights go, Hulkling, it's nice to have two on my team that can take multiple fights. So yeah, let's do that. All right, let's get to the fighting. So I'm going in with Magneto, Nick Fury, and Hulkling. Hulkling is just an MVP for my path especially man best well nick fury as well but for my path hulkling hands down is almost a staple on my teams as you may notice now this first fight against spider ham spider ham doesn't have a lot of health but let me tell you something get hit by him oh my goodness 
he could take away all of Nick Fury's first life in in one move. So it's really dicey. So I play this pretty carefully, okay? He decided to just hit all into my block. I don't know why. All right, so here we go. I'm very careful not to do too many. Now we've got some bars of power. If you don't know how it works, the more uh, bars of power you have, the more likely he's going to evade. Okay, so you see, I don't really want to push him to a special two. I don't know how to evade it. Um, here we go. Now, notice I did not do a full combo. Look at that. I'm dashing back. I'm hitting him. I'm just doing one hit, one hit, two hit, two hit. That is because I'm scared. I am scared of the ham because I have gotten caught by him too many times. I'll do a five hit combo and right in the middle of it, he'll evade, hit me, and it is over with. And I'm like, no, that's not going to happen this time. So he's ner he he's nerve wracking to uh, fight. Not hard. You just got to play it carefully. Now, Captain America, Sam Wilson, that auto block is what I have to remember and not to push him to a special two. His special two hurts. Even into my block, it hurts. So, and I don't know how to evade it properly. So what I wanted to do, if I could, you know, you see the uh, unblockable. If we were not on this node, I could get to the unblockable and then fire that off. But because we're on this node and I get power locked, I'm like, nope, let's wait it out, wait it out, wait it out. There we go. Hit him with a special three. He can't auto block that. If I tried to hit him with my special one or two, he'd auto block it and probably wreck me. Okay. 2% health. Really? That's okay. Uh. Now go to sleep. Tell you. 2% health. Sometimes it's just 1% health. But anyway, we got through that path. Pretty nice, pretty easy. Um, a little bit of stress with the uh, ham. But other than that, we're good. We're good. All right. Now, this is, of course, a, a pretty standard fight by now. This is why I bring in uh, Magneto. Now, I'm curious. I don't know how well um cosmic ghost rider would do i don't have any reason right now to bring in like i could have brought in cosmic ghost rider instead of magneto but i would only be bringing in uh cosmic ghost rider for this fight you know the fight that i usually take on the mini you can't use um energy and i believe cosmic ghost rider does energy attacks so that wouldn't work um, Cosmic Ghost Rider is not shock immune. So the next node, if it has someone that gets armor ups, can't use them there. So it seems like Magneto is pretty much the GOAT for this particular fight against uh, future Ant-Man. Now, if they ban Magneto and they have a future Ant-Man on here, that's going to be interesting. I'm not sure who I would choose. I need someone who is bleed immune that can deal with um, with future Ant-Man and the glancing and, and, and all of that. Mm. That would be interesting. Haven't had to deal with that just yet. Okay, so now... I was going to use uh, Nick Fury here because the Overseer doesn't really get a benefit from this node. Now, I can use either one, Nick Fury or Hulkling. And I decided, you know what? Hulkling been putting in that work. Let's go ahead and just keep using Hulkling. But Nick Fury could do it. It's just that I know that I'm going to be using Nick Fury for the next fight. So why risk losing all of his health and going on to his second life uh, when I have a perfectly healthy um, Hulkling? And sorry for those uh, uh, notifications. I always forget 
to put on my do not disturb. And those notifications uh, don't go away. I actually have it set because of the other, the way the other game goes. I don't want the notifications to go away because I might miss them. And some of them are really important. Like I'm being attacked and I need to go there and defend. So I have those persistent, but it can be annoying when I'm in the middle of a fight because I then have to swipe up in the middle of the fight. It doesn't go away by itself. So when you see it going away, it's because in the middle of the fight, I swiped up on that notification. All right, so now I actually volunteered to fight this maestro. And I had a plan. So maestro gets real annoying with that glancing. Okay, I mean really annoying. And so I said, you know what? I can knock him down. It will go, the um, cosmic charges or whatever, go on cooldown for a little bit. So maybe I can, you know, possibly nuke him down. And I do remember on this node, there is also a um, power drain, which Hulkling is immune to. And so I said, you know what? Eh, let's go ahead and do it. So I brought Nick Fury for a couple of fights and ended up using Hulkling for everything. I could have brought um, someone else that would have supported um, Hulkling. So as you see here, you know, um, it's gonna be a, a longer fight than I wanted because I wasn't able to nuke him all the way down. So now, and don't ask why that happened. Um, spacing issue. My fault. But look at the uh, charges. See, he's glancing. I don't have a um, pierce. Okay? And I'm not sure how to get a pierce. And it's not that you can't do any damage. You can do damage. And hey, look at this. Ah, I hate that, man. I still hate root, by the way. It still triggers me. But... Grip my teeth and just keep going. What else can I do, right? Now, notice that his charges are going down. So I'm just dancing at this point. Just dancing, dancing, dancing. Waiting for it to get down to like under 10. Just come on. Now, I could fire a special off. Um, I don't believe he uh, glances specials. But whatever. Okay, so now... Waiting. Here you go. Unblockable into the special. Look at all that damage. Woohoo! Evade that. Beautiful. And that was that. So a little bit longer of a fight. Had to dance around. But again, you can fire your special if you want to. But I wanted that unblockable special into him. That's what I wanted to do. All right. We'll be back in a moment and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back, and as you can see, we won this war. So we're winning, we're losing, we're doing okay, and stress-free. All right, so take a look here. These are our stats. Shout out once again to our MVPs over there. But that is gonna do it, guys. Um, it looks like we'll probably end, um, if we keep going the way we're going, um, we, we should end in Platinum 3, but maybe 4. Who knows? Uh, I'm not too worried about it. Anyway, that is going to do it. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.